Wool fabric is durable, wrinkle-proof, and holds its shape well. It absorbs moisture and insulates against heat and cold. That's why wool is ideal for clothing such as sweaters and coats. Sheep shearers use power shears, removing the fleece in one piece. They discard any stained or inferior wool, then sort the rest according to the quality of the fibers. This grading is based on length, color, waviness, and fineness. The wool is cleaned with detergents before processing. The wool arrives at the factory in compressed bales. Workers untie them and feed the wool into the opening equipment, whose metal tooth rollers comb out and separate the fibers. From there, the fibers go into the blending room, where air currents mix different grades of wool to get the desired texture. If they'll be weaving a wool blend, they mix the wool fibers with other materials such as polyester fibers. A thorough blending takes about an hour. An air pipe transports the blended fibers to the next station. On the way, sprayers lubricate them with a mineral oil mixture to make processing easier. The fibers arrive at the carding machine, where they pass through a series of rollers with thin wire teeth. This untangles the fibers and lines them up parallel to each other. This process also removes any pieces of debris caught in the fibers. The carding process produces a smooth, flat sheet called a web. Equipment divides this web into thin flat strips. These strips go through rub aprons, two rollers that twirl them into thinner rounded strips called rovings. The rovings wind onto a spool. Rovings look like yarn, but if you pull on them, they simply tear. They haven't yet been spun, so they have no strength. So each roving goes into a device called a spinning frame. It stretches the roving and spins it tightly, producing wool yarn. The yarn winds onto a bobbin. Spinning gives the yarn strength. Now they can weave it into a wool fabric. A fully automated loom does it all. Watch in slow motion as it inserts one strand at a time, crosswise, through stationary lengthwise strands. It's computer programmed to thread in a specific under-over configuration according to the type of weave. The loom inserts 400 strands per minute. After weaving, they burn off vegetal matter such as straw fragments, then dye and dry the fabric. All wool fabrics undergo finishing to give them a particular appearance and feel. These spiked rollers created a plush finish. Woolens can also have a sheared or flat finish.